Hi, I'm making three sponge today. Vanilla sponge, chocolate sponge and red velvet sponge. For vanilla sponge, I have taken half cup wheat flour, half teaspoon baking powder, one fourth teaspoon baking soda, one eighth teaspoon salt. For chocolate sponge, I have taken half cup wheat flour. From this, I will take out half tablespoon wheat flour and instead add half tablespoon cocoa powder, one fourth teaspoon baking soda, half teaspoon baking powder and one eighth teaspoon salt. For red velvet sponge, I have taken half cup wheat flour. From that, I will take out half teaspoon wheat flour and replace it with half teaspoon cocoa powder, half, half teaspoon baking powder, one fourth teaspoon baking soda, one eighth teaspoon salt. Now I will sift dry ingredients for each sponge twice. I have sifted dry ingredients twice. I will keep baking plate on metal rack. Place it in oven. Grease cake tin with oil. I have taken 6 inch grease cake tin. Now I will place a butter paper into the cake tin. Applied little oil onto the butter paper as well. I have taken 1 fourth cup powdered sugar in a mixing bowl. I have sifted and taken the powdered sugar. First I am making vanilla sponge. I will add 1 fourth cup fresh curd to this sugar and mix well. To this I will add 1 fourth cup oil. To this add 1 fourth teaspoon vanilla essence. Sift and add dry ingredients. Mixed half of the dry ingredients. Now I will sift and add the remaining dry ingredients and mix well. Next, I will add milk and mix well. I added about 1 fourth cup of milk. This is the consistency. And to that, I further added half tablespoon milk. Do check the description box for details. Now, I will add half teaspoon vinegar and mix gently. Transferred cake batter to cake tin. Tap the cake tin few times to remove the air bubbles. Preheat oven to 150 degree. Set the temperature using preheat button and then press start button. After the beep sound, place the cake tin in the oven. Set temperature and time and press start button. While the vanilla sponge is getting baked, we will prepare our chocolate cake Batter. For that again I have taken 1 fourth cup powdered sugar. To this I will add 1 fourth cup fresh curd. I have sifted and taken the powdered sugar. I have taken a different bowl to do the mixing this time. After mixing curd and sugar well now I will add 2 tablespoon oil. Next I will add 1 fourth teaspoon chocolate essence. You you can add vanilla essence as well instead of chocolate essence. Sift and add half of the dry ingredients. Mix well and then add the remaining half. To this I will add milk and mix well. I added about 1 fourth cup of milk plus 1 tablespoon milk. This is the consistency. So our vanilla sponge is ready. It took about 10 minutes to bake. Time depends on the oven we use and the amount of batter. I have covered the vanilla sponge with a cloth and kept it aside. I have washed and dried this cake tin. 
now i will apply oil on it again and place a butter paper applied oil on the butter paper as well now the batter for for chocolate sponge which i had kept aside i will add half teaspoon vinegar to it and mix gently always add vinegar just before baking the cake transferred cake batter to cake tin tapped it few times to remove air bubbles preheating oven to 150 degree as the chocolate cake is getting ready we'll start mixing our red velvet sponge batter for that i will add few drops of red color to milk added about 5 drops of red color you may need more or less drops depending on the color you are using and the shade you need i will keep this milk aside in a mixing bowl i have taken 1/4 cup powdered sugar i have sifted and taken this to this i will add 1/4 cup fresh curd and mix well and then add 2 tablespoon oil along with 1 tablespoon butter i will add this 1 tablespoon butter to the oil mix sugar and curd well now add oil and butter mix well add 1/4 teaspoon vanilla essence and mix well sift and add dry ingredients in two batches and mix well next i will add milk and mix well chocolate sponge is ready i am again using the same cake tin i have washed it dried it and then greased with oil placed a butter paper in it to cake batter i will add half teaspoon vinegar and mix gently and transfer it to cake tin and tap few times to remove air bubbles preheat oven our third red velvet sponge is also ready this sponge took about 12 minutes to bake chocolate sponge took 15 minutes to bake you can use cheese cream frosting to assemble the cake thank you for watching the video